Thank you for the 11 months of membership, dude. Izzy said on Ariel's show that he was just waiting on Pereira to gas. That's why he wasn't throwing back when he was rocked. Uh, I didn't see that. I haven't seen the Ariel interview. I've seen the Andrew Schultz one, and he was saying how he was still in there, and he was fine, and it was his leg that was stopping him from moving. Like, dude, you were fucking rocked. You know what I mean? You were out of there. Like, it was my leg. I couldn't put weight on it, and I couldn't move away. It happened in round one. Okay, dude. Straight away in round one. First kick he threw. Hit the perennial nerve. Couldn't feel my leg for the whole fight. Like, shut up, dude. Thank you for the $5, JG Mod Me. I appreciate your $5, good sir. Poatan. Botched. Indeed. Thank you for the $5, dude. Um, I don't know. He's he's doing well by going on the shows and doing all the interviews. But I'm hearing a whole bunch of excuses, man. Like, I'm hearing excuses covered by... But it's all right, though. He did that to me. Like, it's like he makes the excuse... And then chucks up. But I'm still humble and accepting it. Excuse, excuse. But I'm I'm absolutely okay with it. It's fine. You know what I mean? That's how it goes sometimes. Thank you for the five New Zealand dollars. I appreciate you. Fight Sport Talk. Media saying Alex was doing nothing before the finish is a joke. Like the Yan fight. They'll talk more about the name than the actual winner. It's fucking annoying me, dude. Dude. Alex Pereira was straight winning round one until the last second, literally the last second of round one, where it swayed back to Adesanya in terms of scoring. Round two, Pereira won round two. He just clearly outstruck and won round two and got a takedown at the end just for the sake of it. Round three, he got beaten 10 9 because he got out grappled the whole time. Fair play. Round four was like Israel's round, pretty clear. But Pereira was still in it. And then Pereira was just winning round five and then found the KO. You know? Like, he was in it the whole time. If you look at the stats, this is not like an Usman Edwards where Edwards has a good moment in round one and Usman just fucking dominates all the other rounds. This is like a... He was in it nonstop. It's 91 to 86 on significant strikes to Alex Pereira. He was up on significant strikes by the end of the fight. Fair enough, the finishing sequence comes into that. But he was up on total strikes without the, uh, the finishing sequence. You know? 23-23 in round one. 20-17 to 17 in round two. But Pereira landed way better shots in round two compared to Izzy. And then round three, 14-8. to eight, Round four, 20-15. This was like a close fight that Izzy was edging as it went on. You know? And then round five... 28-19, Alex Pereira. He started to do his thing. 